Hello everyone, this is Dave with Learning Media Arabic and today we've got um, an article to listen to from Russia al Russia Today, which can be found at rt.com and this is about the visit of the Secretary of State of the United States to the Gulf. So let's listen and then we'll go over some vocabulary. في سياق آخر يواصل وزير الخارجية الأمريكي جون كيري جولته الأولى منذ توليه منصبه حيث عقد مباحثات مع نظيره السعودي سعود الفيصل في الرياض تصدرتها الأزمة السورية والملف النووي الإيراني هذا ومن المنتظر أن يجري كيري في الرياض مباحثات مع نظرائه الخليجيين المزيد مع الزميل حسن نصر معنا هنا في الاستوديو إليك حسن Okay, just a short introduction to the story there um. So to start off, um, he's changing subjects from his previous subject. So he says, uh, it's in English we might say, in other news, although siak uh, generally just means like context. So in another context, we're moving, moving on to something else. American uh, Secretary of State, we may also say Minister of the Exterior, but Secretary of State John Kerry, uh, continues his trip, his first trip, since his taking over of his position, where he's hold he's held uh, talks with his counterpart, his Saudi counterpart, Saud Faisal, in Riyadh. Uh, the Syrian crisis and the Iranian nuclear portfolio, they call it, or the issue has uh, led discussions or has been in the forefront. This and it's expected uh, for or that uh, Kerry will in Riyadh uh, carry out discussions with his counterparts or his Gulf counterparts. More with our colleague or just colleague Hassan Nasser with us here in the studio. And he says, to you, Hassan. So, um, just a very simple uh, introduction to the news story. Uh, some interesting things to point out is uh, the word counterpart and the plural for counterpart uh, here. Um, I thought that Fisiach and Akhar is good to know. Um, and a little bit of the studio talk. You'll hear that a lot. So it's good to, to get that automatic so that you're not tripping over it when, if you're listening to it. Um, all right, I hope you learned some new words. Uh, it's a very quick one today. So um, see you next time.